money ain't wealth. And that was the phrase. And that's why it's on my Twitter profile. It's like, and it's really money alone isn't wealth, you know, to say it properly, because ain't, ain't a word, right? It's, uh, it, but and that, so it just became a thing of like money ain't wealth. And I just went down this rabbit hole of like, what is actually wealth? And wealth, uh, fi money is only like, you know, 20% of it. And so there's four other areas of wealth and like faith, family, fitness, and fun, and finance is the fifth. And so a lot of people, when they don't have money, they're just obsessed with money and chasing it because they need it. It's Maslow's hierarchy. Once you take care of that money equation, hopefully you're saying, okay, I, now I have a little bit of a breathing room. Let me work on all the other areas. If I'm not as healthy as I should be, so let me take care of how I eat, how I sleep, how I work out. Um, you know, my relationships, not just with my family, but my friends and my coworkers, et cetera, like all the relationships, can they be better? Are there any toxic people in my life that I have to cut out? Um, the fitness side talked about obviously, uh, finances. Uh, and then I didn't do this cause I was so chasing money and career oriented and then trying to get in shape, but the fun aspect, right? Like you're, you, you gotta enjoy life go to a concert, go for a walk in a park, take up a hobby, hang out with friends, buy experiences, not stuff. So like all of these things came together and it's the five areas of, of wealth, the five pillars that I just started thinking about more and more and more. It's just being mindful of that, you know, that you should date your spouse, that you should go out, like you should make time for things. Like you should try to be present when you're with your family or relationships or even meetings. You know, go to that happy hour, break bread, you know. So it's like all of those areas that just lead to an overall level of, of happiness, like that just raises the bar and you just feel wealthy, you know, grateful and happy for, for life. Um, but obviously, if the finances are lagging, that's where a lot of people's attention um, and mindset go 